I just need to make sure I don't uh, delete it this time. Is there a way I can record? No, you can. You don't fuck up. <laughs> Hey, welcome back to our stupid racks. I'm Corbin. Man, you good, them, Zach. Are you speaking on your mic? Please make sure your mic oh. is. Is it connected correctly? No, I'm is. saying, is it is under preferences? Is it using that mic? Yes. Okay, it better be. Uh, anyways, yeah. uh, welcome back. Uh, I'm Corbin. That's Zach. And uh, we are today. We're doing a movie review of the. Um, 2017 hit. Yes. Tiger Zinda High. And you're probably wondering, hey, didn't you guys do Eek the Tiger as a watch along? Why is this just a watch along? Why why is this just a Uh, Dum Dum Face Corbin, uh, we did the entire watch along and uh, then. Three hours. Yeah, Corbin accidentally deleted the file. My wife was pissed. No, I was too. It it upset me for like days. I know. I'm sorry, but <laughs> it upset me for days. Uh, and so yeah, yeah, dumb dumb Corbin uh accidentally deleted. And no, it's not just in my trash. And I contacted I contacted like data recovery people to see if I could get it. The way I deleted it, uh it, it's it's gone, gone, bye bye. Um it was a stupid mistake on my part. So that's why you're not getting a watch along of it. I apologize. So this is going to be our second time. And it was about good. It. it was so much better than the first one. The watch along, uh, not the movie. <laughs> um, but uh, so, yeah, we're going to go over, obviously, spoiler reviews of uh, Tiger Zinda High, High for the second time uh, with you guys. So you guys can know our thoughts before Tiger 3. Is that what it's just called, Tiger Three? I think it's just called Tiger Three. Like they they went from Eek the Tiger, Tiger's in the High to Tiger Three. It's the third one, guys. Yeah, that's like children. The third one yeah. doesn't really. Third one doesn't matter. Uh, I'm the only one with three, so I can't. I, I know. <laughs> the but third one twins. definitely matters. But it's twins. So it's, it's basically it's, like it's basically you have two kids. I only have two. Just, kids. You only have two kids. The second one is just two different people. Yeah. Uh, also, uh, I bought Zach a mic, uh, so yes, and a better you. quality camera. So uh, that was also for the watch along, uh, but you'll never see that. Anyways, Zach, what did you think of Tiger Zinda High? I enjoyed it for what it was. Uh, uh, it was a political action movie. It wasn't as enjoyable as the first one, mm -hmm. but it was still good. And I still yeah. love, I love Bye. Bye. And uh, I thought he did great. Yeah. yeah I, what do you I, think, I, Corbin? I felt the same way. Uh, I'll, it's a better action movie by far than the first one. Mm. Because, um, but in terms of, I enjoyed the kind of small, intimate, quirky romance kind of feel of the first one. Uh, and I was hoping they'd bring some of that back. And it was, it, it was just a, a little humor. They but still have they, a good chemistry. Let's throw that yeah, word yeah. in there. They have a great chemistry. Bye and uh um What's Katrina, her name? Uh, um Cat. Uh Katrina Kaif uh have great chemistry still. Um but yeah, the the overall film itself felt a little more generic action than the the in the first one even though there was generic action like generic action plot in the first one it just had these quirky little feels to it that i that i was really enjoying um and this one was like i said a better action like a thousand percent a better action movie than the first one there was there was a lot of really good action scenes there was a lot of good cinematography like set pieces is are those your bike glasses yeah i was supposed to wear these when we started and i forgot <laughs> Uh, a lot of good action set pieces and stuff like that and it it i think the action yeah the action was incredible it, was, it yeah. did get better yeah um if i can compare it to and i'm gonna interrupt you because you took okay, go ahead to, go right ahead. <laughs> um if i can compare it to an action movie or types of action movies it reminds me of like um especially in the western uh films um like Zero Dark Thirty or those 
those military movies that we have. It was really much remind me of like a like a war movie that we got. Um, yeah, that are heavy in action. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, I thought um, I know this is the first thing you've seen Salman Khan in the the, the these two films. Yeah, I like him um, together. I thought he did once again well in this. I I was hoping his quirky side that was in the first one would come out a little more though. Yeah. But I mean, he does, cause he does that very, that cheesy, serious action man really well. Like when he yeah, was yeah. fighting everybody in the, with the smoke and he had the mask and after he took it off, it was just like, it was a typical action movie. And I think he does that really well. Yeah, I agree. Uh, and their chemistry was still great. Katrina Kaif, I thought, did a, another really good job in this. I love their chemistry together. She, I think, has better... Uh, she has a more agile body, so... <laughs> oh, yeah, her fight scene was so much... Yes, you're right, because he's... He's, a he's just big and bulky. He can't, like, uh, do, like, the martial arts like she can. But... And she did her own stunts. We can agree to that. Yeah, I think they both did a lot of their own stunts, but it looks like she did, like, in terms of the MMA stuff. I think she did. Yeah, because that was I think there's yeah, some her behind, fight scenes were intense. I think there's some behind the scenes um, of these films. So if you guys, if they're subbed at all, you guys can let us know if they're something we should check out. Yes, but yeah, please. yeah, she, uh, her, her fight scenes, she did a very good job. She was very believable. If it was a stunt double, I it looked just like it was Katrina Kaif uh, uh, doing these MMA kind of. I don't know. I I assume it's MMA where they're just yeah. They're called twisties other. and flippies. She did a lot of twisties and flippies. Twisties and flippies. Um, that's in the biz. That's what we call it. Um, um, there's something else I wanted to say before I forget. Oh, I loved the uh, because I feel like this was more of an an ensemble than the yeah. last one was because we had her team and his team and I really liked those characters. I thought they did a yeah. really good job of fleshing them out, and I loved the banter where, of course, they're from different sides, I'm Pakistani and then uh, the Indians, and then um, of course they come together at the end and wave their flags, and I loved yeah. it. The page and then that, love it. the little weasel guy that was working at the uh, with the oil refinery. Yeah, the uh, his name is um. What do you got? What's his name? Uh, uh Par- Parish Rao Raoul Raoul Raoul. Yeah. I don't know. I Rick love it when you use your tongue to Rick. Usually, you love when I use my tongue. <laughs> yeah, I love it when you use your tongue. Oh, sweet. Ra- yeah, I I enjoyed his character. A lot. Yeah, me he's, too. He's a really good. We've actually seen him quite a few times in other films. Uh, he was he was yeah. funny, but he's a he's actually a very good actor, which is no surprise that he plays in this film like a, one of the um like fun uh, supporting characters. Yeah. I I often think supporting characters in films are a lot more interesting than most of the, especially action films. Um, the supporting characters are way more interesting to me usually. I know. Than, yeah, I know. They've uh, always been. You can play. You. Uh, you can play James Bond. I'll play the villain any day of the week. Every <laughs> or the quirky day. sidekick that. Oh yeah, every day, over the uh, over uh, James Bond. Um, what do you man. think of uh, what do you think of all the songs in this one? They didn't have as many dance numbers or but songs. We loved, and you, if you would have seen the watch along, if some idiot didn't delete it. Uh, the last Remind song was me. great. What, oh, it was, the last uh, song was a oh, week. Oh yeah, it was. Uh, hold on, let me. Yeah, I know. I love the last one. I was almost sad there wasn't. Uh, I was like, there wasn't any dance numbers in this one, and then at the end, of course, there was, and we loved it. Yeah, and I think there was, was the first one. There was like I three. Think there was I think. two other songs in this one. Um, yes, you're right because in I the think beginning, it was the beginning with her. He had a when love he, song when, when he painted on the snow. Yes. <laughs> yes. Um, and then what was another one? There was another one in the middle, but it was more maybe just a background one. Uh, yeah, I think you're right. Um, I almost I think, forgot about that one. I think they uh, could have done with, I think this was 240, I think is how long this film was. <clears throat> it probably could have done with being chopped up at least 20 minutes. There's probably uh, some things that have been a cut. Little, a little snappier um, to keep the audience a little more engaged. Um, but 
like I said, overall, I enjoyed it. Um, I would watch it again. I think in terms of if how I rank them, and I know you haven't seen all of them yet. I it's debatable. Uh, it I think the first actually Tiger is my favorite of every other, which is funny because it's the <sighs> least act the least action of them all. Uh, is probably my favorite just because of how quirky and fun it was. I, I really enjoyed the first Tiger. And then it would either be this one because I think overall this one's a better film. Uh, but Patan, I think, has a better first half. Um, okay. A lot of quirky funness. Uh, but I, I think it falls off in the second half a little bit. Um, so it would be those two and then War would be at the bottom. Even though I enjoyed War, but it was a lot of just mindless action is basically what War is mostly um uh, kind of that's sim- what really gets you if if the plot is good and i feel like this plot was really yeah. good yeah the um, plot of this the one story might be better than the first one it's just the, it was, the first yeah. one was like quirkier more enjoyable the, the 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 love interest um i was hoping like there would be a little more love even though there was like that love song in the beginning and yeah. I know they're already married and have a kid. So, you know, love is dead at that moment, I guess, and is what they say in films, right? <laughs> yeah. You don't you don't have to love each other anymore. You don't love any, anymore. And after you especially, especially with you kids. kids. <laughs> especially. <laughs> I haven't uh, talked to my wife in six years. <laughs> <laughs> um but yeah, that would probably be the it would probably be maybe even the first two tigers and then Bataan. But you could you could sway me into thinking Bataan over this one as well. Just uh, the first half. The first half is way better, and it, it does have a lot of CGI issues in in Bataan. Okay, there's I a have lot like of this CGI one issues. didn't have because there were some no. CGI issues in the first one. Yeah, this one I didn't see any. Uh, I think it was no, more they had of a, a lot sh- of practical. This one was more of a shoot 'em up. If any, there's a lot of shooting. Yeah. Um, and, but then you get uh Katrina's uh fight scenes were were beautiful. Yeah, she did a great job. The- um, yeah, that was awesome. Anyways, uh, I once again, I'm very sorry that you didn't get a watch along of this. Uh, no one is more angry at it than myself. Trust Honestly, me. Who just wants to watch two people watch movies? Anyways, I don't understand. I don't understand the the appeal. People like it, man. No, um, but uh, when we will get to uh, Tiger three as well uh this weekend um well maybe hopefully hopefully um I'm shooting a movie this weekend uh no it's with it's for valerie it's, um, oh okay, okay. it's like That's an official cool. th- it's like an official thing like producers makeup art like there's it's a whole it's a whole thing is it a like, short film a short yeah, feature or is it it's a short that's part of a, a feature oh yeah it's confusing it's sci-fi kind of thing Anyways, okay, uh, but awesome. we will get to okay. Tiger 3 um, and let us know what you think uh, about Tiger Zinda High. Which one is your favorite? Is it the first Tiger? Is it this Tiger? What's your favorite of the spy universe? Let us know down below. Also, what's your favorite fruit? I just want to, I'm just curious. My, I love mangoes. Are you, are you, are you kissing ass right now? <laughs> no, that's my favorite fruit. Is that, that is a thing? thing? That's. That's like the national fruit of India. I'm sorry, I didn't know that. I'm I'm not doing a bit. Mangoes are my favorite, <laughs> and I eat them here. So, I, uh, and they're not ever in season. So, I bet no that... mangoes here are absolute shit. I love mangoes. No, you need so to. So I'm I wanted I need to try it. I'm New gonna. Mango. I'll see if I can send you a, a full box because I I had a person send us a, a box of Indian mangoes. Oh, yeah, no mangoes, a bunch my... of different kind. And then I'll send it to you, and you can do a video. <laughs> okay. Yeah. No. I'm glad Let I brought it up. I was just trying to be weird, but yeah, mangoes are my favorite. Let us know down below. Uh, 